Okay, um, there's two things that come out of this. One is that, is that regulation is becoming harder to administer because of the World Wide Web, so people can buy services abroad. And also there's a danger that the people buy um, bad drugs. I have a pharmaceutical, pharmaceutical distributor in my own constituency and they're always trying to look for um, drugs that are, that are made that, that, that are, are, are phony. And the second thing is that it hasn't come up tonight, and you really need to, we really need to be aware of this. There are people out there who are actively campaigning against complementary alternative medicine, particularly organisations like Sense About Science, um, Taxpayers Alliance. If you look at the people who back them, they tend to come from very large corporations with a vested interest. Um, they will try and rubbish um, what you're doing, and you need to fight back. And I, have, I had a go at them the other day because I raised in the chamber the links between astronomy and astrology and Ayurvedic medicine and Chinese medicine. And I said that the scientific community, some of the scientists were superstitious because they were reacting emotionally and not rationally, that they were ignorant because they didn't know the subject, and that they were prejudiced and racially prejudiced at that. And not many of them have come back, but you know, now is the time for you to be to believe in what you're doing and get out there and, and be more aggressive. You know, we need, we need, your, you're on a roll anyway. Everybody wants your services. They're everywhere. And you need to have confidence. And that's one of the reasons I took that on the chin, as we say, decided to hit back. Because it's no good them saying it's all nonsense, there's no evidence. There's plenty of evidence. Evidence in homeopathic medicine, Lionel Milligram, people like that have got at an institute. There's lots of research, but they don't take, they don't, care to look at it. So you go and see your members of parliament, you say, look, this is what the people want. You know, the old saying in British politics, you can, you can, um, people vote with their feet. They're, they're, all these shops in the high streets wouldn't be there if it didn't work. People are not idiots.